Intermediate English for Class 12 Khyber Pakhtunkhwa Textbook Board, Peshawar The contents of the book are Vision and Mission Hope and Aspiration Duty and Responsibility Courage and Determination Technology, Gender, Inequality Cultural Heritage The Past and the Present, Tales from Shakespeare. So, Vision and Mission. These are seven units over, listed over here and each and every unit again subdivided into six chapters or lessons. So, in under the heading of Vision and Mission, you are going to learn the Farewell Sermon, Jinnah's Vision of Pakistan, The Blades of Grass, that is a poem, then grammar portion, three units for related with grammar, parts of speech, noun phrases and noun clauses. Then hope and aspiration. The second one is, you are going to learn under the heading of this second unit, I have a dream, glory and hope. I dream a world, this is a poem. Then pronoun. Pronouns, relative pronouns, and pronouns, and article you are going to learn. Unit number three, that is duty and responsibility. Under this unit, you are going to learn the lessons. Lesson from the Battle of Ohoth. Ling, Ling Gong Gryu. If poem. Tenses. Verbs and models. Transitive and intransitive. Then the next one is courage and determination. You are going to learn the lessons. Determination, the man who planted trees. It couldn't be done, poem. Adjectives, adjective phrases and clauses. Unit number five, technology, gender and inequality. You are going to learn technology and society of the future. Gender inequality is determined determination determinals to society this these tools are s's then the school boy is a poem written by william bleak then adverb phrases clauses prepositions and preposition phrases then the sixth unit cultural heritage the past and present under the heading of cultural heritage past and present you are going to learn the lessons Archae Archaeological Treasures of Pakistan The Renaissance Once Upon a Time is a poem Then Figure of a Speech Narrations Voice Then Unit Number 7 The Last Unit This is the Tales from the Shakespeare And the different tales are The Merchant of Venus King Leo and then grammar portion, paragraph writing, essay writing, and intonation. So here the content list ended. So the contents for each and every lesson, you are going to uh, unit, you are going to have story and essays, poems, explanation and paraphrasing, translation, English and Urdu, summary, Exercise question answers, grammar part of speech, direct indirect voices and some MCQs. So I am going to tell you about the paper pattern. So according to your board paper pattern, section A consists of maximum marks 20. And question 1 is about MCQs and MCQs are 20 marks. Then section B marks 50. Here question 2 starts, attempt any 10 parts, part 1 and 2 are compulsory. Each part carries 5 marks. So here you are going to have the explanation and reference to the context. And there is an option, paraphrasing, paraphrase the stanza or do the explanation. Remaining parts 2 to 13 are exercise questions of lesson so you are having three op options over here but this question two 
point one is compulsory for you. Then in section number C, its total marks, maximum marks are thirty. Question three, attempt any three questions. Question number three is compulsory. Each question carries ten marks. So here you can see question number three is compulsory. That is about the S's. S's and question four, five, six, seven. There is a choice. There are two question choice for you. If you want to attempt direct indirect, good. If not, then pair of words, summary or character sketch. It's up to you which two question you choose. So here I end up this session. I hope you understand your scheme of studies, your content list, and your paper pattern. Thank you.